Hello and welcome back friends and if this is your first time visiting then welcome to Semper Infinitos DIY. I'm so happy you chose to stop by and if you have not subscribed to my channel I really hope you consider subscribing. Okay so I am going to be making a heart chocolate lollipop. So I am going to be using two different colors of foam clay and I want to make sure that they're very well blend so once I have it all kneaded out and then I'm just going to go ahead and roll out my clay, then use the cookie cutter that I got from Hobby Lobby and cut my shape out. Once I have my heart shape, then what I'm going to do, uh, because I want to actually give it a, I want it to look like someone took a bite off of it. I am going to use a separate cookie cutter and then try to cut what's going to mimic teeth marks. Once I have my teeth marks already printed in there then I am going to go in with some fabric paint and add the chocolate all right so I have never done a lollipop this huge I am a bit nervous because I have no idea how it's going to look like but I am confident enough that it'll come out just fine all right so now that I have my shape cut out I am just going to make sure that it's all um cleaned all the way around and just by pressing the clay back in shape you know you can use a, a a tool if you like if not then just with your fingers all right so this is the cookie cutter that i chose to make my teeth marks with and um i didn't want to make it too big nor too small so we'll see how it comes out Okay, so now that I took the bite off the side of the heart, I am going to start decorating it. First, I'm going to add the frosting and I want it to start to look like, it, well, I want it to look like it just started dripping, so I'm not going to add a lot. Then I'm going to add some glitter. Once I'm finished with adding the glitter, then I'm going to go in and add my message across the heart and I'm going to use the color neon if I'm correct. Um, and then... I will add the chocolate where I took the bite using the cookie cutter. Once my heart is a little drier, then I am going to go in and uh, add my wooden uh, lollipop stick. Now, I to me, the stick looked too plain, so I wanted to dress it up a little bit. So I'm sure most of you who have ever um, used fabric paint have noticed this, but for those who have not, and this is going to be your first time doing it or using fabric paint, you always want to do like a little test on a piece of paper. And I mean by test is like try to make sure that there's no air inside the bottle because when you go to make your design um, and if there's air capture in there, it's going to splat your paint and that's just going to probably even mess up your cute design that you're planning to do so I always do a little test first before you go in also guys uh, my apologies but you will see my letters somewhat crooked and that's due to the coffee I did try to my best to hold my hand as steady as I could so I do apologize for that uh, but yeah also guys if you like this video please uh give me a thumbs up uh, leave me a comment because i love reading the comments you know um and it continues to inspire me and if you have not uh subscribed to my channel i really hope you consider subscribing it's really going to help me uh it will help it grow so and i am trying to reach my thousand subscriber goal by june <laughs> so anyways guys so yeah you know if you like it give it a thumbs up comment and you know don't forget to subscribe
okay so here's the stick that i'm going to be adding to my heart now it's too plain for me so i thought why not add a little cute bow to it but first i am going to be doing a second heart now this heart i made it the exact same way as i did the first one uh, the only difference is I actually I made it a little bit thicker now to this heart I want to add a foam clay ribbon to it because uh, I thought that would look a lot cuter and So here again, that's all I'm going to be doing is just making a cute little bow from foam clay um, And then once I am done with that I am going to show you how it looks after I finish adding my little cute bow Okay, so here it is. Now, again, the stick looks way too plain for me, so I figured why not paint it uh, two different colors, and then I am going to do that, and then I'll let it dry, then I'll show you, and here they are. Here are both of my lollipop uh, chocolate hearts. Now, I did change my mind with the ribbon, with the uh, fabric ribbon, because like I said, it was what it was just off so i thought this would be a much cuter so what do you think guys i totally love these two how they came out so all right my friends with all of that being said until the next video stay safe be kind bye